welcome to my channel and thank you for tuning to today's video so guys in today's video i'm going to be showing you that we'll be using this my um mix blend ayurvedic or aroma that you uh you can use in your kitchen so today i'm going to be i'm going to be treating my hair um and you know the normal week routine for uh over two weeks now i've not done any, anything to my hair because the weather is cold and it's also uh you know a little bit cloudy windy and you know dry so i don't i didn't feel like doing anything so today guys i've come to use this my ayurvedic um diy blend to uh, make my hair treatment so what i will be doing i'm going to uh infuse this with my amla powder i'm going to be taking um let me say one teaspoon from each of these um ingredients like so this powder is so aromatic guys make yours and give me your feedback it's so so aromatic it's like you can use it as in you know to take order of your kitchen because the aroma is so great so i'm going to also dip in here uh, my one teaspoon of amla so i'm going to give it a stir like so so i'm just going to make uh a tea see fit and then i will go uh for the next uh stage so guys i came in with just uh warm water to just lightly infuse this just warm water not hot okay so i'm just going to give it a stir i'm going to make it, um 250 uh, milliliter of of this okay so just give a stir a light to sit for uh 10 uh let me say couple of minutes like 10 minutes will be okay uh to uh allow it to uh infuse to release the um, the benefit in here so that then we are going to uh do the next thing i love the aroma guys i love the aroma so that's it so guys i've allowed to sit for a couple of minutes so right now i'm just going to go in and filter it with this my new uh baby i love this it sifts that so clear that it will remove every tiny i mean the tiniest um residue of things that you have in your ayurvedic it's going to just remove them i love this i love it so ever since i've been using it i've uh, discovered that is so useful if you are making anything with ayurvedic or anything at home uh do you want to see if it to come that clear or tiny oil um such like so you need this stuff in your kitchen you need it guys so you can still get what you want but less residue so this is it guys so i'm going to start from here right now to add this is my rice powder this rice i washed it i dried it in my oven just to get out the water uh, in it then i blend it okay so i'm going to go uh in here right now with my rice powder so there is no gauge for this i'm going to go until i get it um the consistency that is okay for me to use in my hair so i'm just going to go like so now guys so after making it like so i'm just going to heat it up in my double heat boiler until i get the cream consistency that i need to come because this will turn into cream this is like when you make a uh, rice cream okay so i'm going to do so and come back so guys now this is what i got so i went ahead in my double heat boiler uh to give it a couple of you know just be stirring and until it came this creamy so yeah this is how it should come 
because I'm going to, I just have my hair um, uh, that's not washed with shampoo but I just um, rinse it then I did some uh, clay wash okay so here I got my I'm going to use this as my deep mask okay so right now the next thing I will be adding is my um, orange I'm going to be adding just uh, five drop of this for uh, antioxidants for your scalp so I'm going to go along with my tea tree oil so my tea tree I'll be adding 20 drop of tea tree oil because tea tree oil is antibacterial so because I'm going to apply this to my scalp and my hair so I will also need uh, some um, treatments under my scalp for dandruff for inchy for psoriasis just for the issue that i have naturally with my with my scalp okay okay so after this now i'm just going to give it um a final mix like so so guys check check out the consistency very smooth so if you are making yours and you are doing it in your double heat boiler and you found that um it's coming that thick add more water to it okay so because i went ahead to add some water to loosen it out a little bit because it was coming out that thick and i didn't want it to come that thick so i'm just going to give it a stem to mix with thoroughly like so so right now I'm done you know what guys let's go and apply <laughs> 